The House will now reorganize and select a new speaker. I know it's going to take some time, but I remind everyone we have a lot of work, we have a lot of work to do, and the American people expect us to get it done. The argument we reached uh, was uh, all about what, to, what comes next, but we had an agreement. We reached an agreement over the weekend. Funds for government, only another 40 days. We cannot and should not uh, again be faced with an 11th hour decision on brinksmanship that threatens uh, to shut down the government. And we know what we have to do. We, and we, got, we have to get it done in a timely fashion. More than anything, we need to change the poisonous atmosphere in Washington. You know, we have strong disagreements, but we need to stop seeing each other as enemies. We need to talk to one another, listen to one another, work with one another, and we can do that. I join with Minority Leader Jeffers, Je excuse me, Jeffries uh, in saying that our Republican colleagues uh, remain committed to working in a bipartisan fashion. We were prepared to do it as well for the good of the American people. Twice in the last six months, both houses came together on a bipartisan basis, once to avoid default, once to keep the government open. And while we should never have been in the situation in the first place, I'm grateful that leaders on both sides came together, including former Speaker McCarthy, to do the right thing.